What's going on guys? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. All right guys, another Mars video for you. Uh, this time I'm going back to Sol 1441. Let me show you the one I'm talking about. You see right up here, if you look at Midnight Planets, which is basically affiliated with NASA, right? Uh, pretty much got the same photos on there. And you can see right here, image, and it's uh, a 1441 nav cam. You can see N cam. And of course it is the MSL, the uh, Mars Science Laboratory, right? All right, what I find interesting about this photo is why is it so dark? Let me guess, is it dusk? Sun ready to go down? I don't think there's a case at all. If you look at this photo in the back, okay, it's completely dark in this area right up here. And you go, okay, it may just be the sun's on the other side of this hill. And this is the reason why it is. Well, you don't see any real shadows though. Maybe around here a little bit, maybe. But why don't you see it in the whole rest of this? You don't see it being cast even onto this other hill on the other side, depending on the sun. Now, if the sun was way, way down, you wouldn't even see this area. It'd be so darn dark, right? At least you would think so. All right. So I started getting into this photo. What I found interesting was that this area over here on the right, let's go ahead and try to see if we can bring it up a little more. Right there, it's completely fabricated. And I'm going to show you what I mean because there's some things on this right hillside that don't quite look right. And on this over here, doesn't look right. Let's get into this. Go back to this right here. Reset it. Let's jump into Photoshop. I'll show you exactly what I mean. Now, you might be saying, all I see is a hill here, but I noticed a couple straight edges. I noticed a couple 90-degree angles, so on and so forth. This alone right here on the bottom, not sure what to make of that, but closely, if you look, you can see what looks like white objects laying on the ground. See that? Now, that may be nothing. To me, that could go either way. That could simply be just flat rocks, and I'm okay with that. I found this pretty interesting, too, is that this almost looks like this white piece right here has, like a, has like an arch, and it's kind of raised off the ground. At least that's the way it looks. It may not be, but it kind of looks that way. All right. Let's just go ahead and brighten this whole thing up. Okay. Now I'm looking at this here and I'm going, okay, we got these objects right here. This one. Something up at the top right here. Do you guys see that right there? That's kind of bizarre looking right there alone. It has a shape like this here. And of course it goes back like this here. At least that's what it appears in the picture and has these two black squares I see that, and I've seen this, okay? But look at the way these things, eh, doesn't look too bad. Looks pretty good here. Details looks pretty sweet here in the foreground. You can see your rocks and all that other good stuff, all right? And then when you look in the back, completely blurred out. You can see that. You can clearly see that. Now, let's go ahead and darken this up a little bit. You can see something right here, right there at the bottom. Kind of looks like it has this weird, almost like half pipe kind of thing. Now watch what happens when we enhance it. it. It appears to still keep going down. I'm going to do this on white. It doesn't really matter. You guys get the idea, right? But it has this area right here, and it, can, it looks like it continues down. Now, if you look at this thing, just back up, it looks like it has some kind of square piece right here. It's been covered up. And some other object. You can see that clearly they've been blurred out. You can see that. Look at this item over here. Almost ghosted out completely, but check this out right here right here let's add a little blur to this all right there you are let's back up a little bit guys what the hell look at this it's just some of the things on this on this hillside like i said like i said this item right here alone is just weird man like i said it looks like it's coming off the actual side here has these two little squares. I don't know what the chances of that doing that, but yeah, okay. Okay. And whatever the hell that is, it's got, a, like I said, it's got this kind of goofy look like a car. Now, let's go jump over to the other side on this hillside. Again, is it dark because of dusk? Sun's ready to go down? Or is there something more to it? Let's have a look. Okay. Right at the back, you can see, I don't have to do a thing. To, all I do is just brighten this up. And I'm going to just prove that to you right now, guys. Watch this. I'm going to go ahead and go down, scroll down to shadows and highlights. That's all I'm going to do to it. Okay, we're just going to bring it up. That's all we're going to do. I'm not going to add anything to it. I'm not going to do anything to it. There, there it is. What is all this mess here? You can see what looks like these two white, looks like cylindrical objects right here. See that right there? You've got things that are doing this here. Looks quite wide, in, in fact. Just pieces, bits and pieces inside this photo. Now, what I did do is 
put anything that's in this area that has a lighter color, I actually made it whiter. Here's another thing my buddy said. He said it looks like another car. I'm saying, where do you keep getting this stuff from? But he's, if you look at it right here, he goes, oh, no, no, man, you can see the wheels. <laughs> I guess if you were, if you, I, you know, if you, if you really thought of it that way, I guess you could, right? See it? In that circle? I don't know what to make of that, to be truthful with you guys. I don't know what that is. But what I'm more interested in is this, is this right here. I see these objects in here, and I didn't do a thing to it, guys. I showed you what I did. Here it is right here. I haven't done anything to that other than going like that. Adding, if you can see it right here, shadows and highlights. That's all I did to it. And there it is. Now, let's get into this a little bit more. And you can see where I try to bring it out just a little bit more. The white it areas, just a little bit more. That's all I did. Here's the difference. Docking this up. So let's see if we can get any kind of details out of this thing. And uh, just kind of weird things in here. I mean, look at this. I'm not sure what to make of that. And like I said, this is the kind of stuff is, and eh, it's so iffy, iffy. This here, nah, that's something in the hillside, guys. At least that's what it appears to me. Let's go ahead and blur this up again. And then you can see, like I said, these objects are sticking out of this, this hill. Guys, I've said this many times before. I don't believe what we're seeing here is rocks at all. Um, I'm not saying there's no rocks in here. Don't get me wrong. I'm saying I don't, I don't think this is all like buttes right here. These hills we're seeing here, I don't think this is all buttes. And if it is, if it's a hillside, a rocky hillside, then these things are built into it. One way or the other, there's artificiality in these photos. There's intelligently made objects in these things. Now, I don't know what any of this is. It kind of looks like a framework thing going on right here. And I'm going to go ahead and zoom into it right here. This here, it looks like weird framework in a hillside here. Not sure what to make of that. You guys tell me what you think. What are we looking at here? Now, is it possible these beings built into the hillsides? Absolutely. How could we done it here on Earth? Why is that hard to believe, right? And I believe they absolutely did. Or this is being completely disguised, because you can see even here the texture doesn't even make sense. Like, these are actually structures, and they're making them out to look like they're all one, like, like mountain ridge or hill ridge. You can see these things, like, really faintly, like this here. And these objects right here. I can't tell you exactly what they are, but clearly that doesn't look natural coming off of a hillside. Something's there, and something was there. Now, if I bring this back to the real dark photo, which kind of sucks and it's hard to see, but you can see these objects right there. See these two little white cylindrical pieces right there? They're there. This right here. I can see it right there doing this. I like that. I don't know if you guys can see this, but I can see it pretty darn well. This other white piece right here. Let me go ahead and lighten that back up for you. There it is. Whatever it may be, I think it's I think it's artificial. And you can see this right here. This is such fake crap. It's it's not even funny. All this whole area right here. Even if we blur it like this, you can see what looks like individual things. That may be laying there, and of course there's no real detail to it because it's been blurred over. Um, but clearly you can see there's multiple things, and it's not flat, meaning you can just go right here from this, this foreground all the way through and just drive right over it. There's actual objects here. Whatever they are, there's, there's pieces there all in a row. And I can see that just by looking at this. Look how, oh my god, look at that. Everything else seems to have pretty decent detail, even the hills. You can see the, the, the hillsides and everything else look pretty good until you get to this part right here in the middle. That's like absolute garbage. Why? Because this thing's hidden in this photo. And this is the reason why they made it so darn dark. Yeah. Just bringing it out a little bit more. Yeah. Anyway, guys, nothing more than just hillside. I think there's more to it than that. Again, you guys get the last say. Tell me what you guys think. Comment and drop your thoughts down below as always. What are we seeing here? Nothing more than a simple hillside or is it something built into the side of it? What do you guys think? Don't forget to like and please share the video. Always appreciated. You guys know that. You know, without you guys, the channel wouldn't exist. So by you guys spreading the word and getting this stuff out, other people get to see it as well as be more enlightened. 
Anyway, guys, stay tuned. I also have another moon video coming up that'll be on the new channel, Lunar Anomalies and Beyond. I'll have it in this description box down here, my pinned comment in the comment section. As always, you'll be able to get the link there as well. So don't forget to jump on over there, subscribe, hit the bell, um, and this way you'll get the uh, notification for the next video come up. Same thing with this channel. If you haven't yet subscribed, please do so. Hit the bell, the notification bell, and this way you'll get notifications of the next videos coming up on here as well. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Always appreciated, and I'll see you in the next video.